Hello friends, welcome to my YouTube channel Dad to Be. I'm a first time dad and today I want to share a mistake that I did while assembling my Graco Nimbalite stroller. And it is an honest mistake, it can be done by anyone. And the mistake that I did was on the brake pedals. So instead of having them positioned on the outside, my brake pedals were uh, pointing inside, which were of no use because I couldn't access them through my foot. And I'm going to share with you, you know, the mistake I did and you know how you can also prevent uh, doing the same mistake. And I'm also going to show you the solution in case you did that, the same mistake I did. All right, so check it out. So here is the Greco Nimbalite stroller that I just assembled. And uh, the mistake that I did, you know, uh, if you see the rear wheels portion, the brake pedals are on the inside in the invert position rather than being on the outside. So in short, you know, it is of no use because I cannot really use the brake pedals with my foot here. They're supposed to be on the outside. And you know, while I was assembling it, um, the, the brake pedals fit in snugly and you know, I didn't think, and I assumed that this was the way to do it, but it isn't. And you know, I will have to sort of uh, disassemble this again. And you know, I'll have to pull out these hubcaps from here. And I believe these do not come out you know, but just by using your hand. So I'll have to use a knife or a sharp object to pull these out from both the rear wheels and then this metal rod and then change the position of the brake pedals. Uh, so this is, I'm, I'm gonna do that as well. I'm gonna show you how to do it, how to remove the, this hubcap and you know, how to again, uh, put the brake pedals in the right condition. The brake pedal is here. So here's my Graco Nimbalite stroller in an inverted position. So I'm going to disassemble the rear wheels so that I can correct the brake pedal position. So instead of facing this side, the brake pedals should be facing on the other side. And it's not apparent, you know, while we are assembling it, but when you assemble it fully, then you realize what the mistake you have done. So I'm going to disassemble, disassemble this rear wheel first. Uh, and I think the first part is to remove the hubcap over here. And this doesn't come off just by using your hands. So you have to make some efforts. So that is why I have, uh, you know, a knife uh, and also a flatted screwdriver, uh, you know, just for support so that I can remove the hubcap. So I'm going to try and remove the hubcap with the knife here. Uh, it's sharp and pointy and I believe should do the job. So I'm just going to find the spot, uh, you know, using which I can remove this hubcap. Yeah, okay, so I did find a spot here and I'm going to use my flathead screwdriver just to just for support Yeah, and I'm going to point this Knife to in the opposite direction as well and you see it should come off easy now Okay, it's loosened up There you go the hubcap is removed and now I need to remove the pin as well Okay there you go, the pin is done. Removing the wheel. Uh, I have the hubcap and pin removed already from the other side. And now I just need to remove the rod. And now comes the brake pedals, which was the mistake. So I'm now removing the brake pedals and I'm gonna put it in the right direction. Uh, yeah. So this is one, instead of like this, it should have been on the opposite direction. And I'm gonna remove the other one as well. Okay. Now this brake pedal will go here, in this direction, click. And the other one here, click. And that's it. I think the rest of it is just gonna be putting the rod in and make sure. So I was finally able to assemble my Graco Nimbalite stroller in the correct manner, correct way. This is the fully assembled Graco Nimbalite stroller. And see, if you see the brake pedals, they're in their right position. I can use my foot to brake, non-brake, and that's the right way to do it. And I was able to do it this way.